we are entering into another season of you know heat okay um Dudwana, you all, most of you know that uae is made of is is about a 70 percent summer here it is about a 70 percent summer here and <laughs> I need to sound this word of caution to each and everybody who is or who intends to travel to the UAE from this month or from the next month till September. You know, we are getting once again into a new season of summer or heat here in the country. And I think you should know about this before you make that move of leaving whichever country you're coming from to come job hunt here okay if, if you're if you're a tech savvy if you're someone who knows a lot about technology if you can do online search for job i'd advise you try to do them before you get into this country don't come with the intention of you know coming into the country and then depending solely on working interviews or walking around to seek employment it is going to get very hot here it is going to get very nasty here <laughs> well i shouldn't use nasty but it is going to get very hot here whereas when you need a job you would have to you'd have to be indoors be with your laptop and be searching online for these jobs now when you see tents being erected in this part of our <laughs> lovely country then you should know that it is time for our muslim brothers and sisters to start fasting and praying to the almighty allah for forgiveness and a fruitful year ahead during this time of the month muslims actually observe a fast from dawn until sunset fasting is believed to be a private act of worship bringing about nearness to god as well as a form of spiritual discipline and a means to empathize with those that are less privileged or less fortunate you know it is that time of the year once again where <sighs> the climate begins to change and things begin to get kind of worrisome in case it's your first time here most of times we experience winter here in the uae from september to march talking out of experience or giving out my experience my little experience about summer here in the uae this climate is not conducive for people who are who intend to job hunt by walking in or walking around to seek you know to hunt for jobs or to look for jobs when you intend to seek jobs and you are coming here on a tourist visa whereas you are actually dependent on working interviews or working you know stuff then you should also consider the fact that you would be using the public transport much enough because you can't stand the heat that is involved when you try to move around to you know job hunt it is not an easy task so therefore you would have to pack a lot of money to you know carry you along when you try to move from one place to the other to look for employment most of the times we hit about 50 degrees celsius which is about a half of the melting point in temperature it really happens it happens most of the times and during these seasons most companies are supposed to reduce their working hours so that they could meet the the fasting timings and also be able to get themselves um, on track another thing i would also love to advise each and everybody intending to move or travel to the uae to see greener pastures is to be very careful with um the kind of people you trust okay moving into a country where you have no idea about or you have no clue about what really happens in that country is very dangerous it is risky if these people who intend to make you move from your home country to come see greener pastures are indeed good people and these people really want the best for you i think they should educate you a bit about what you are really going to face when you move into this country or into these countries they try to lure you into i beg you should also ask questions you know sometimes most of us only follow blindly we kind of listen to people who have barely little experience 
you know one one thing is most of these agents who actually con people into you know slavery are people who are stranded in the country and need serious help like if <laughs> they don't even have documents themselves so if a person without documents is trying to lure you into a country telling you you can you know get yourself lots of opportunities that you don't even have any clue about then i think you should actually ask him or her questions as to what really runs or what really happens in this country now there is this new form of fraud or scam by setting people in some parts of <laughs> of this country you know scam is made to be believable such sweet words or very believable people actually approach you telling you they can help you secure jobs in a country i wouldn't limit this to uae because there are lots of countries in which this thing or these things happen now they are able to get you genuine visas they are able to get you genuine tickets and then they are able to get you into the country that they are supposedly asking you to come to now on tourist visas you come into the country where they tell you you are coming here on entry visas now on reaching the country this is what happens now they give you job contracts to sign supposing to be genuine or legit but at the end of the day these contracts are fake contracts and they are never genuine in any way now after signing the contract you think you have a job or you think or you might think that you've had you've secured yourself a job now working for a whole month they now tell you <laughs> you are not needed you are no longer needed in the company and therefore you need to pack your things and leave which makes it very very difficult for people to you know get back on their feet because you come into a country where you intend to see greener pastures you work or waste a whole month working thinking you are going to earn some salary and at the end of the day you are told to leave the premises because this whole charade or this whole um you know um you know uh process of getting you from your country to this country was actually fake bro i just need each and everybody out there to be wise i want people to wise up as to how to as to the kind of people they trust they are traveling in, like the, the the kind of people they trust in yeah so if you are here and you need an agency or you need someone to help you through securing your documents in traveling to the uae i think i have a trusted source for you now just link up with me in the number i'm going to put down here and then i'm going to direct you as to how to get to them and then how to reach them so that your documents will be processed for you for your travel now be it tourists be it employment be it freelance visas they are very good at it and they will you know get it done for you in a very you know short while like a very short while so um just do all to link up and i'll direct you to them now um if you intend to come if you intend to travel to the uae i think there's the best channel for you there's one of the best channels you can ever visit for information about how things are run here in the country now if you want to see more videos about how to get to the uae and things needed for you to get to the uae just visit the card over here and you get to know more about what happens here i've done series of videos explaining stuff here what happens here i've also had interviews with people who are already in the country and are operating very well some are well doing some are people who actually came here and couldn't find jobs i mean you can learn from every one of the videos are posted here because they are very educative and then they are also very informative so you can learn from each and every video i posted out here and then also know how to put things in place before you get here into the country i think that does it i would just end here by saying a merry christmas to each and everybody out there and a prosperous new year as we enter 2024 2024 is going to be very great and I guess you'll be great too. Until we meet again, stay safe, stay out of trouble, and be good. If you haven't subscribed yet, do well to hit on that subscribe button and be a part of the family. See you on the next one.